Okay, we're going to show you how to fit one of our turbo tube modules to a Mini Countryman 1.6 diesel. First of all, you need to remove the plastic engine cover. It just pops off. It's just on rubber mountings, so pop that off. Move that out the way. Next thing, put a soundproof in here. Just lift this up. When you lift this up, you can see the diesel common rail running along the top. You've got the metal fuel pipes coming off to the injector, so we're always looking for the metal fuel rail. On the end of the fuel rail, we'll have a common rail pressure sensor and the original connector on here. So what we're going to do is remove the plug, put it off to one side. Okay. See our module has two connections. The first connection we're going to put into the pressure sensor, listen for the click. That's it in nice and tight. Second one, dead easy. We'll marry up with the original connector. And that will also click nice and tight. Okay. Pop the soundproof and back down. Next, you need to find somewhere to mount the module. We're going to come round, tuck it round here, and we're going to mount it along here using the Velcro attachment supplied with the module. So you make sure the surface is nice and clean. This one is, the car's brand new and there's no dirt on there. So mount the module. Right, we're going to switch the module on. So we've got the on off switch at the top. Um, this switch here controls torque. You have low, medium and high. We'll always start off on the medium, and this one controls brake horsepower. You've got low, medium, or high. Again, we're going to start off on the medium. That gives the best balance between increased performance and improved fuel economy. So, what we need to do now is pop some cable ties on, tidy up the wiring harness, and that's it. Job done. the engine cover. Now we'll go, that's it, job done. All you're left to do now, start the engine, go for a drive and enjoy the extra power. <laughs> 